Hey guys, Cruel Blind Wave. I'm Eric. Rick. I'm Calvin. Aaron. And we are here with another movie reaction. Movie reactions that we do every single week, by the way. Mm -hmm. This time, Encanto. Uh, a new Disney uh, movie that has gotten a lot of buzz, heard a lot about, uh, and I'm excited for. You guys heard anything about Encanto? Cito. Absolutely nothing. Hope I'm saying it right. Until I saw it on the Patreon, Paul. I wasn't even aware of it. What are you even aware of it? No, it's... Uh, um, I was recommended this movie by DeBaba a bunch. I think yeah, Debaba got like uh, retweeted or like answered from one of the creators, right? Hmm. For something. Oh, really? Yeah. I think I saw. I think I know two things about this. Yep. Maybe three. I know. I don't uh, understand. I've seen an ad I, that was unskippable on YouTube. I guess I can say. I guess I can say <laughs> Damn one. Come and get premium. <laughs> I suppose I can say ah. one thing that isn't necessarily story oriented. Yeah. But it was about uh, Lynn Manuel Man Miranda. Manuel Miranda being involved in. This. The person so famous from Jabba Flow from Star Wars The Force Awakens. Whoa! I was thinking of him being involved in Into the Heights. Oh, uh, and Hamilton, yes. I, I guess those are Hamilton? also good. Hamilton? Yeah. What's that? Huh. Uh, Hamilton reaction you can check out, actually, from oh, the channel as well. That? Um, Eric, I'm going to skip that whole setup. Almost. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, uh, I'm, I'm excited to see it. Uh, this was voted over at patreon.com slash blind. Like Rick said, on a poll that we have every other week where you can help us choose some movies to watch. Uh, yes. This is one that we probably wouldn't have picked on our own. So, will we be thankful that you helped pick it? We'll find out. You have well bed were forced to flee our home, and there were many joined us, hoping to find a new home. I love everything that's being lit by it just that lantern. The dangers, and your abuelo was lost. Hmm. But in our darkest moment, we were given a miracle, and it blessed us with a refuge in which to live. Whoa. Huh. Sanctuary. A place of wonder. That's great. Place of wonder? Our casita itself. Man, that'd be such a right? confusing moment right there, right? Of like, you just lost your husband and now you have a place to live? Is it like, <laughs> a, is it his sacrifice that did it? Or maybe his spirit in the candle. With a magic gift to help us. Each has a magic gift. They got magic too. <laughs> That's hmm. right. Is it a magical family? Oh, our finest gifts. What the heck? Is it alive? Yes, Casita. We're going. It's the floorboard. Oh, I think it's abused in the morning. <laughs> yeah, is it just the, it's just the house is alive? Yeah. The, the floorboards okay. are moving on the clock. Makes sense. What's your gift? I don't know. Summon scorpions. Who else lives here? The whole family. Well, how do they keep having kids? They, they have gifts. Bring other <laughs> like they, do partners they, in. Do they leave this yeah. paradise and bring in new people? Never get anything lost in the again. Dude, she just was so walking. Handy. Her shoe just hopped on her foot. I love this house. I want this house. I want my house to do this. Me too. We need a sound system with bass. Make it really proud. Yeah, we do. Morning, Willow. Whoa. Whoa. The other thing I know is that this character is voiced by Rosa from Brooklyn Nine Nine. <laughs> this is my family, a perfect constellation. Whoa, look at this room. Ah. That's what I knew about. Awesome. I knew there was like one real strong girl somewhere. Okay. I knew that. So everyone has like their own superpower kind of? Yeah, everyone has a gift of some sort. So this girl wanna make a deal with the devil. Hell we might. Ah! Oh my god! If you're impressed, imagine how my arm literally did that at one point! So your foot. It wasn't that bad. Oh. There are so many people here. Yeah. A, they like these sanctuary. are the people that came with them when like a whole when they were forced City, out. Right? Yeah. The, the hair is so amazing. <laughs> in terms of the animation. And each new generation must keep the leaf so burning. That's cool. Wait, who's the sister and who's the cousin? There's so many people. I get that for a pretty round of sex. 
It's so fun with the accordion. <laughs> Accident prone, it's not a gift. It's a curse. This whole chorus. That's really good. <laughs> oh my, it's so fast. Kid is savage. Yep. I made a rainbow. Maybe her gift is not having a gift because of. I don't know. Maybe the gifting ran out. Like, Maybe her gift is being positive. Baby's night has to be perfect, and it's not perfect. And people are going to be coming. Oh, God, she like could be powerful. It's like Storm. Some would say flowers. Oh, like poison gosh. ivy, but magical and stuff. Our angel. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Although this is really advice. If you weren't always trying too hard, you wouldn't be in the way. She's right, I'm on. First gift ceremony since yours. He gets done. A lot. Yeah. Accent from Jesus. That yeah. guy. Mm -hmm. Outside, uh, she's no gift. Mm -hmm. Never ever would. Surrounded by the exceptional. It was easy to feel. Oh, His fingernails are. Okay, puppy. I'm just saying. Fucked. Take Memo that ring off. I never want to talk. I got oh. it out. Oh. The house isn't going to decorate. Wow. She heals, right? Oh, she gave him some food, and he got better. So the best way for some of us to fail is to step aside. Let the rest of the family do what they do. She's going to be the Lex Luthor of the family, right? <laughs> she can make a, a bad suit? one? <laughs> I know you're an animal guy. She makes this, made right? This, so she had a bunch of yarn. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You always have something to snuggle with. You can make it come alive. It seems like a gift. This house. <laughs> I love this house. All right, on besito. I can't help but think what that does in the bathroom. Sorry. Like if these walls could talk. <laughs> the terrible things that could go wrong, right? The things it's seen. <laughs> Do you ever feel like you don't have privacy? I mean, it's a house, but does the house have eyes? Well, we used to poop and bathe together all the time. He said poop. It's a little it's fair. It's a Disney movie. You I mean, don't say poop. I said fuck at least three times. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ah, two asses. Eric. Disney. That's actually what they're called. Calvin. Make out your papa proud. I don't sound like that. I don't sound like that. Abuela says it's time. We'll be waiting at your door. Okay, okay. Mickey okay, gets one. Okay, okay. <laughs> he gets the one to rule over all the others. The power to steal other gifts. Aww. Yeah. If she goes out and it doesn't work, I'll blame her. Maybe she has a gift of, like, giving people strength, but it's not as obvious of a power, so you don't realize it. I mean, that one guy probably doesn't have a power. He's just accent prone. Well, he's not... Um, it's not his real gift. It's not a gift. He just is accent prone, right? Because he's, he's not part of the family married into it. Yeah, he, yeah, I think that's what they said. Yeah. I don't want to see his little disappointed. Go away. Flashback. Forward. Flash forward. She just needs to eat some hair. Mm, OK. 
Okay. That door just disappeared, huh? Mm. All right. I suppose she didn't get power. Her power is to destroy doors. I hope he gets a gift. I'm already, too. I'm already too invested. I need to get out of here. Okay. 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 That good. Seems good. That worked. <gasps> Affinity with animals. You can summon scorpions. Talk to animals. Sup, motherfucker? <laughs> All right, do it all. Of course they can come. <laughs> oh no! All of the birds of the jungle. <laughs> no. That's gonna be a lot of poop. <laughs> you can't so, say poop in a Disney no. movie. All the animals. <laughs> they're gonna be shitting everywhere. Man, he figured out his power immediately. That's pretty good. That's a new pet. Uh, Wait, do they all live in here? Uh, yeah, he gets, yeah, he gets he a, has like a little room. zoo room. She didn't get a room. So oh my gosh, it's like a little dimension. Yeah. Wow. This is awesome. I want a house like this so bad. It's like a TARDIS. A TARDIS. Oh no! Oh, big hug! Oh, okay. I thought he was going to eat him. <laughs> Behold the gift of nature. <laughs> That'd be so good. <laughs> This place is just on the outside, it'd be awesome. Let alone right. inside your house. In my room? My room. I can piss in my room. <laughs> Don't you have a bathroom in there? You could piss in your room if you want. <laughs> <laughs> I never thought about it like that. Kevin's like, this is the highest point of my life. <laughs> piss my own room. That's even Wait, harder on her. Bitch? Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Anyone. Everyone, Everyone with a gift. With a gift. <laughs> well, she wasn't even in the house. She right. was standing outside the front door. Dude, how'd you leave her out? That's bullshit. Can't believe we left her out. Fucking dad's. What's there. Felix's power? Oh, man. Don't feel regret. You're sad at all. Feel those things. It's natural. I can't move the mountains. Rosa also was in in the heights. Yeah. So she's singing that too. I can't take another night. Now I'm gonna guess. Guess she can't stop time her. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, is this like in her mind? Because this looks like a gift. <laughs> But what's up with Bruno? He sees the future. We don't talk about Bruno. Maybe he's gonna show back up. That's the thing. That's what's gonna happen. Uncle Bruno. Am I too late for a miracle? If it happens every time, is it a miracle? Wouldn't it not happening be the miracle? Well, it's a continuation of the Whoa. a miracle, right? No. What happened? The house. A house divided cannot stand. Pain or afraid? Oh. Uh oh, what's going on? Is this a vision? I don't know. I don't know what's so. going on. Like, no one's. Where'd everyone go? Was it all real? <laughs> no. What happened? I think it's just her, her thoughts. Oh, what a great place to party. So you're just all in the inside. Look at Look at this kid. I, it goes without saying just how amazing this looks, right? Yeah. I, 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 we can't just say it all the time. It looks no, so good. I'm tired of you saying it. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> the house is in danger. The tiles were falling and there were cracks everywhere. And the candle almost went out. Show me. I don't see any cracks now. Mm. Maybe her gift is like incoming uh, danger sense, doom. and it's just nothing bad happens, so it doesn't happen all the time. No, she has a door. She doesn't have a door. The magic is strong. She knows something. She's not letting anybody else know. She knows something. Yeah. She made a deal with the devil. And he has come for his payment.
But what are you gonna do? The house is like, fuck yeah, baby. Gotcha. I'm in. Here's your shoes. How do I save a mirror? Okay. Okay. I'm like, what are you gonna do? <laughs> but there is one person in this family who's Bruna. everything about everything. Yeah. Oh. Calvin. Shut the fuck up, Eric. <laughs> oh, and Lisa. I heard her eye twitching all night. How do you get sleep? We are all thankful for Antonio's wonderful new gift. I told that to one that you see. Aw, nice kid. Dolores says you're totally freaking out. Any chance you maybe know something about last night with the magic? You do! Meet up. Tonight, he wants five babies. Wonderful. Such a fun. Wants five babies tonight? Not a lot of chores. Four so asses. Maybe you should just go home. Lisa, my house five. is leaning to the left. Dolores said your house is leaning. It never twitches. Something's making you nervous. No, you're going to make me drop a donkey. A donkey. Donkey! Why would anything be wrong? I'm totally fine. The magic's fine. Lisa's fine. I'm totally not nervous. <laughs> your eyes. It's audibly I'm twitching. Strong one. I'm not nervous. I'm as tough as the crust of the earth is. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I'm the mountains. I'm the churches. And I glow because I know I'm worth it. Of course. I mean, <laughs> I don't ask how hard the work is. Got a rough and destructive surface. Diamonds and platinum. I find them platinum. I take what I'm handed. I break what's demanded. But under the surface, I feel the circus. A tightrope walker in a three ring circus. Under the surface, was Hercules ever like yo? I don't want to fight Cerberus. Oh my god, she's pushing the iceberg away. Are they implying that she saved the Titanic? No. No, she's That's keeping her, girl. she's trying to keep her family afloat. Yeah. And she changed time. Stop. Stop. <laughs> I like her deep timbre for a female voice. No mistakes, just press it like a brick, 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 then it won't let go. Background dancing. Still it's ready to blow. Whoa, oh, oh. Give it to your sister and never wonder. <laughs> Once before Theo Bruno left, he had like some terrible vision about it. Theo Bruno? What was in his vision? No one knows. They never found it. But if something's wrong with the magic, start with Bruno's tower. Find that vision. He had a tower? Yeah, Wait, a tower. How do you find a vision? What am I even looking for? <coughs> if you Jeez. find it, you'll know. I was wondering why they were on Careful. that. So she could do that. Why can't they walk? So that's his tower, huh? Mm. So he stays here? No. Or he just this is he, an empty This is where away. he got his power, so he had a door and they locked it away in a tower. I thought like they lock him in a tower? Damn. I mean He's one of the three He's a Disney main, princess. He's one of the three main children, right? Yeah. Hourglass, see the times. Sands of time. Oh! Um, There's no floor! Oh, okay. oh. That's not bad. <laughs> like, no! Oh, oh, her face! Man. It's not great. I hate sand. Oh my gosh. In your mouth would be awful. Irritating. It was in her eyes. Gets everywhere. 
Whoa. Your future awaits. Dude, what is his power that he got this room? It's visions. We know his power. Huh? His power is visions? Is no, the, they just said that he had a vision, Is Antonio right? here? Visions of the future. He's the future. <laughs> Ghostbusters Tower. Where do these stairs go? They go up. Oh my gosh. Oh, fuck this. All that for nothing. She swing. Smart for operating without any powers. The bird's falling. Okay. I think she's gonna make it. Oh, oh, Jesus! My goodness. That was loud. <laughs> that was so long. I like how the birds freaked out. Who can fly? Look, he's so judgy. <laughs> he's so disapproving of her. Where? He just left. He left. <laughs> I'm out. Are they all pieces to put together? Yeah. Maybe this isn't a good Seems thing. Seems bad. She's merging the realms. That's you. Would she destroy the magic? I bet that's what the vision was about. She's gonna die. Oh, okay. She's totally fine. She needs the handle. Oh Don't gosh! Don't fall off the. Very close. Cliff. Oh my gosh. But then when I went to throw the donkeys in the barn, they were heavy. Heavy. <laughs> <laughs> We don't talk about Bruno. What if you didn't understand what he saw? Then you better figure it out because it was coming for you. We don't talk about Bruno, no, no, no. We don't talk about Bruno. But this guy's facial animation. I really like him. Sorry, me be that go well. Exposure on that camera. I'm so no, good. Well, I mean, he told me that my power would grow like the grapes that thrive on the vine. Mariano's on his way. song so far. What's the name of the kid that can transform? Do you guys know? C-A something I-O. Cameo? Are you? The cracks? Pants on because I. 
<laughs> I broke into Bruno's tower. I found his last vision. The family's in trouble. The magic is dying. The house is breaking. We skipped his beating, and I think it's all because of me. <laughs> Just act normal. No one has to know. Oh, gosh. Dolores. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Don't blurt it out. <laughs> She's gone. Oh. No. He would turn to burn it for a second, didn't he? Fix your face. Yeah. Camilo. Camilo. It's going down the line. <laughs> He's so nervous. Why do they keep telling people? Oh, oh no. no. She thinks it's her. Oh, <sighs> My Mariano wanted to begin with a song. Of course, song. Lisa, could you bring over the piano? Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I feel you. They're bringing it together. Shits. They're so smart. This is a shit show. This is a shit show. The one. Oh, the cracking. Oh, what the heck? House does not like him. Oh my gosh. Senora, por favor, please. There's gotta be an explanation. I hate you. Oh, I'm what did you do? I'm not doing anything. Everything is fine. We are the mother dogs. Not everything is fine. Oh. That guy's bald. I love the. That just happens sometimes, Calvin. I know. What's the opposite of a miracle? Curse. A curse. This is cursed. Has he been hiding in the walls this whole time? The rats have. Is this where Bruno's been? There's no yeah. rats in the walls. It's just been Bruno getting food from the rats. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, that's so good. That was really cool. That was really good. Now he's gone. Oh, jeez! <laughs> Did the house not know he was here? I think I made it for him. Gotta make, gotta make the jump. Gotta make it. Gotta make it. Oh, nice, my gosh, girl! Oh. oh my gosh, that one little stick! Bruno, help! Ah. No. help. Fucking bamboo! Oh my no. gosh! I imagine Bruno saves it, right? You're very sweaty. Oh! Oh! No! No! Oh my god! I mean, it's, that was. Okay. okay, it's not that oh deep. Oh my god! That's ridiculous! It happened to Bruno. <laughs> it's just right there. We found the bottom! <laughs> oh my gosh. That's Catch amazing. it! Bye. What? Bye. All the patching's done by Hernando. Who is, is that rat? I'm Hernando and I'm scared of nothing. Oh. I say my real gift was acting. <laughs> I'm Jorge. I made those tacos. <laughs> it's been here a long time. Long <gasps> <back here. laughs> oh my gosh. That's oh, amazing. Hey, I make the spackle. <laughs> mm, right there next to the family. He can Get away sit from his eat. family. Oh, he made a little dinner Man. spot. That is so fucked up. Fucking sad. Well, anyway, I, I think you should go because um, I don't really have a good reason. But if I did, you'd be like, I should go because that's a good reason. <laughs> <laughs> I need to use that. And, and there was no one answer, no clear fate. Like your future was undecided. Hmm. Knew how to Maybe they don't anywhere. need the magic anymore? Uh, I'm Bruno. That's all I know. I wish I could have seen more. Yeah. Why don't you have another vision I wish now? I could have seen more, so see more. Do have it. Have another vision. 
Oh, you wrecked my vision cave, which is a problem because I need a big open space. We'll find one. Where? Who's my room? Don't eat those. Don't eat those. Our family needs help. And you need to get out of here. Maybe it didn't give her a gift, a magical gift so that she could save the magic. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Maybe it gave him the gift telling the animals so he could know that Bruno was in the walls. All is as the force wills it? Kind of. Like maybe it gives gifts because it knows what's coming. Hurry the future. Mm. <laughs> he just went around it. <laughs> Aww. Fucker, that's so sweet. Tio Bruno. Yeah, I got a big one. <laughs> yeah, I got a real one now. Regifting. <laughs> <laughs> that capybara is gonna see some shit. Okay, cracking. Of an Encanto is that itself. Up the mountain? Yeah. Uh-huh. You're looking at the same thing that I am. If there was something else. Yeah. Over there. Is that a flower? Butterfly. Butterfly, butterfly effect. Follow the butterfly. You're a fighter. What? Wait, no, no, no. Is that a hug? Am I fighting or hug? That's a hug. An embrace. An embrace. To make the candle bright, it's the to abuela. embrace her. Embrace who? Oh, almost there. Who is it? Almost there. Oh, oh I got it. Oh, uh, what? Isabella! <laughs> yeah, turn Isabella. Isabella! Sister, that's great. <gasps> I hate her. I'm <laughs> <laughs> that is a long armed baby! <laughs> and, and if that was in live action, I would have been terrified. You're exactly what this family needs. You just have to see it. By yourself, after I leave. <laughs> <laughs> He's walking away as a plane. I love the shaky cam. I'm bringing you home. Knock, 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 knock on wood. <laughs> <laughs> He became like all superstitious and stuff. Yeah, no, I, I fully expected Bruno to be like a antagonist or something. He seems pretty cool. Just gonna save the miracle with a hug. With a hug. <laughs> apologize for ruining my life. Go on. Never hugging you. Sorry. That your life is so great. There we go. Uh, wait. Fine. I apologize. Ugh. Ugh. Trying to ruin your life. Ugh. Some of us have bigger problems, you selfish, entitled princess. Selfish? I've been stuck being perfect my whole entire life. And literally, the only thing you have ever done for me is... Sister wants to uh, marry cactus? Him. Why is there a cactus? Mm-hmm. That's not a flower. I mean, there's a flower on the It's a cactus flower. I nice. just made something unexpected. Something sharp. Something new. It's a. Uh, uh, this she likes is it. Her own. It's not symmetrical or perfect, but it's beautiful. And it's mine. What else can I do? Wait, bring it in, bring it in. Good job. Bring it in, bring it in. I make perfect practice. Oh, it looks like poison ivy there. Yeah. What extent can she control plants? Is it just I mean that's a whole fucking tree. It's a yeah, it's a giant palm. 
I think that's the idea, right? That you're like, talking about. You do like red Does it have to? It doesn't just have to be flowers, right? I get microphone. <laughs> He's accident prone. <laughs> oh, cool. Boy, oh, don't need to be perfect. Hey! That's an embrace. That's good. Like, she doesn't have a gift, but I feel like her gift is unlocking how people really feel. She could be a support class. Kind of, yeah. The Bart. <laughs> kind of, yeah. Because of you, Luis is losing her powers. Isabella is out of control because of you. I don't know why you weren't given a gift, but it is not an excuse for you to hurt this family. Judge, a judge, a judge, Grandma. Yeah. Look, look what you're doing, Grandma. You suck. No matter how hard any of us tries. Right, Bruno's in the fucking wall. Bruno left our family because you only saw the worst in Bruno him. Bruno didn't care about this family. He loves this family. I love this family. We all love this family. You're the one that doesn't care. Oh, shit. You're she cares about the magic. Our Don't you The ever. miracle is dying because of you. There's the vision. Casita, get me up there. I'm oh trying. man, that's so cool. I love this house. <laughs> huh? Luis man, well, Miranda has ah, uh, she lost it. The best sets. He does. <laughs> that one spun. Lin Manuel. Yeah, Luis. Lin. Lin Manuel Miranda. Lin Miranda. Yes. <laughs> Him. Lin Miranda. That name. Sex man. Go, my children! Hamilton. Yeah, we saw this. Oh no, Bruno! Oh, no! Save! Jorge! Oh. <laughs> Thank goodness Jorge was here. Run, run, run! Oh! Oh, thank you, Casita. It's dying and dying. saving her. Oh! Oh my gosh! House to life. <laughs> uh, it's like waving goodbye. <laughs> this fucking movie made me care about a house. <laughs> Is Bruno gonna find her? Or Antonio would be a good one. Hmm. You can guess her. <laughs> I didn't Did want, want her to show up. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Butterfly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, guys, a fun way of <laughs> revealing that. When I get why she cherishes the magic. But it's insular too, like they don't have a connection to the outside world. The butterfly. Follow the butterfly. There's the, the There's grass. The grass. Everything's out of order, he said. He said to me, you.
Torch. <laughs> I, I misjudged what we were doing here. <laughs> we'll work into the night. That's what he's saying. Yeah. Well, thank you for coming. It's a real miracle. How to make spackles, so that's helpful. Uh huh. Butterflies. <laughs> Jorge. Hey, Mariana, why so blue? I just have so much love inside. Oh my gosh. You know why I've got this cousin? Yeah. Too. Have you met Dolores? Okay, I'll take it from here. Goodbye. <laughs> Back? The yeah, imagine the magic go back. 
Unless that jaguar is stealing that kid. <laughs> Rest. <laughs> ah, ice. <laughs> cool. Yes. <laughs> That's the tiniest flash pan ever. <laughs> and now she's in the picture. Mm -hmm. Oh, fuck yeah, and Bruno. Oh, real mad they let you out of that picture. Yeah. You had a casting thing that you were saying? Or something? Just right oh, no, I was just... I I kept trying to figure out who Bruno was. Oh, yeah? Um, during it. And I'm like, man, who's Bruno? The voice sounds so familiar. And then when it got to here, I'm like, ah, John... L I never know how to say his last name, Luiziama. but Luiziama. I'm like, yeah. ah, that's who it was. Okay, but it was just, it was, I'm like, who is that voice? I swear I know him. Yeah. Everyone else, I'm like, I don't know if I know them for sure. But him, I'm like, something's familiar. I don't know what it is. Luigi Mario. Luigi. <laughs> Luigi. Yeah. Oh, we gotta watch the Mario movie, Calvin. <laughs> Man. Also, the Toucan. I saw that. Alan Tudyk. Was it Alan Tudyk? That makes Tudyk? sense, dude. He yeah. always does. He was the chicken. Funny. He's always in, in Moana. In Moana. Right? In Moana yeah. and different yeah. stuff. He's always doing weird voices and stuff, and it's great. Great. All right, well, Encanto, what'd you guys think? I really liked it. It was a fun fun little movie. I mean, yeah. nothing crazy, but I quite enjoyed seeing kind of like, a, I don't know, like a, the Colombian identity mm -hmm. shown a little bit. Just like a family displaced by violence and insulating themselves. I thought it was cool. Like the whole thing like took place just in this house, you know, this this little area. Mm -hmm. No. It was, it was fun. I liked it. Um, I enjoyed the, uh, I don't know language-wise, like even like... For, for like my name, I know Aaron means something, and I know Elliot means something. You know, there's a reason that that's my name. Yeah. Sure. I don't know necessarily what they are, but like the their the names they had, like Ma Magical, made me think of magical. Yeah. And then Mirabelle, also Ma Miracle. Mm -hmm. I'm like, I, I I like those kind of pairing with like these words that I do know. Mm -hmm. But I'm like, I wonder if like do those mean those kind of things in you know like in Spanish or something? So yeah, I, I don't know, but I, I did like that, and I also liked uh, Mirabelle. Like her, the idea of her like not having a gift, but I'm like, I feel like her not having a gift, like she understands more of like, it doesn't mean that I'm nothing. Almost like a mirror to Abuela, right? She doesn't have a gift either. She like no brought Hers the is... miracle and 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 raised these people, but yeah. like she's kind of like a family staple, and it feels like f not from a different time necessarily, but from a different uh, setting that they're in. And now they're kind of in a peaceful place, but she's. She's still fiercely protective, right? Like they ostr like the ostracized Bruno, which is like the worst thing they did in the whole movie. You know, sure. Ten years but that man lived in that wood. <laughs> there's there's a mixture there because also like I thought they kicked him out, yeah. but he seemed to have left, left. because yeah. of the way they treated they his treated visions. Him. Yeah. Um, yeah. Which I had thought it had just been more of a they they literally just sent him away. Mm -hmm. Like you are forbidden to be here, banished along no. those lines. So no, they said yeah he left when they were talking about how he could see the future yeah. and stuff. But I think like Mirabelle it could, is kind of like an answer. Like if the miracle was an answer to we need protection now, right? Whether it's like a fulfillment of sacrifice or whatever the 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 reason that this thing happened, I think that like Mirabelle could be the next reason, the next thing that needs to happen, the next way the family needs to move on from their trauma. Sure. I mean, her not getting a gift, and that's what I was talking about too. Is like this miracle, like giving gifts and stuff. Does it yeah. does it do it for reasons? You know, like, mm. does it choose the vision and gave that to Bruno? Did yeah. it choose the healing? Because, oh, well, we need to heal. Did it, um, who was the other sister that had the weather one? Was that the other sister? Was that the older one? Yeah. yeah. Uh, right? Tia? Uh, she was like aunt? Yeah. Well, I'm looking at those three. Oh, like, the, yeah. three siblings the three siblings of, of Abuela, which was yeah. the healer, the visions, and the weather. Like, uh, like, did it choose those for reasons at the time, you know? Like, mm -hmm. we need to heal. We need to be able to kind of see what's coming. Or is it personality-based? Yeah. Because, like, she seemed very emotional, and her emotions changed very quickly, kind of like the weather can do. Sure. But, like, you know, having uh, having strength and being able to build and carry loads and, you know, that kind of stuff, like, was a reason for that. Is having Antonio getting the ability to speak to animals opening the door to make sure, like, did they give Dolores hearing so that he would she would hear... Bruno on the walls, but she didn't hear that yet, you know, she or she didn't or say she, it. she said she like, heard rats. Yeah, like, is the house trying yeah. to, like, get them to, like, hey, we're working together, but all they see are their gifts, and yeah. since Mirabelle didn't have that, she's like, you're, you know, the idea that you're more than your gifts. She opened up 
uh, Louisa to you know her whole her whole song about under the surface mm -hmm. like I'm strong and I'm holding all this weight and mm -hmm. doing all this stuff but I'm cracking under there you know it just keeps until it gets to a tipping point yeah so like Mirabelle was like the first I think to really try to dive into that same with Little Miss Perfect right like yeah her and her perfect persona, but she's like, you know, being perfect, you know, look at this, it's a cactus, yeah. you know? Yeah, like, Mirabelle was, was like kind that. of like, like a, a, a cornerstone of the family that they need at that point. Yeah, right? you, you need to Where look at... Abuela was, but Abuela has, you know, kind of fallen from grace. She's <laughs> looking at the magic, and yeah. like, we need this magic to be safe, which I understand because she lost someone very important to her. About sure. preserving you know? rather than progressing. Yeah, right? but yeah. the reason we are safe... Yeah. Like, sure, it could be because of the magic, mm -hmm. but we're here as a family, and that's what should be the main importance. And Mirabelle not having the gift, but she sees everybody for more mm -hmm. than just their gift because she doesn't have a gift. Yeah. yeah. Like, that's kind of like, I, I was wondering if, like, I don't know how the magic works, but I was, like, in my mind creating, like, maybe it chooses for reasons, and it didn't give her a gift because they need someone not to well, have a gift. Well, how come that kid can just turn into anybody? How is that helpful? <laughs> my one thing is, like, okay, they have these abilities to be able to, like, protect and insulate themselves. But, yeah, I was thinking, like, what is it? Like, I, okay, strong person, I can see that, and, you know. Yeah, a healer. Can, he's a healer. Who but, can control like, plants. A chameleon, I guess, like, is the ultimate spy. But I don't know, like, how much did they use their gifts to actually protect and defend? Well, they didn't have to, though. You know, they didn't So, like, have maybe to. he's more for entertainment. Maybe. You know, sure. maybe it's, maybe she, the flowers is for, for, sure, like, we need fruit and stuff yeah, but also yeah. just for decoration and yeah. happy and the garden in which they can live without yeah. thorns yeah. sure yeah I don't know like I was just wondering if there's more to it like that mm -hmm. especially from like the creator standpoint of like why did they have these powers yeah. was there a reason or just like what's a cool power to have shape shifting yeah, yeah like what's a fun animation that we can do for a song yeah, yeah. it's like oh which animals man the uh, it's the animation like the I just couldn't not stop. Like we talk about in Star Wars Rebels, like I hate that hair. Like this is the opposite of Rebels in terms of like I love this hair. <laughs> yeah, the hair yeah, was amazing. It looks so the good. Hair was good. And I like that. You know, uh, uh, you know, it's it's Columbia based, so we have like different you know representative skin tones and of mm -hmm. the family. It's not just you know uh, one outlook of life. And I and the, the the how you build that hair is like they put a lot of care into that. Mm -hmm. You know, I really liked it. Yeah. And I'm glad. Especially, I like I like that Disney's doing more stuff like this, and I feel like they're bringing in people that can help show that history, that know it yeah. or have be, lived you know, it or whatever you know, like things like that. Like to be able to just, just the cast in this and having Lynn involved in the in the songwriting yeah. and yeah. stuff too, to be able to help influence the the feeling and the tone and the history that they're yeah. going for. Which I definitely, having listened to a lot of his stuff, like I could like hear him singing these. There was definitely Lynn Manuel Miranda's like. Cadence and style being yeah. sung by other people. Sure, <laughs> especially it's definitely the, the Bruno a, a style. different style than yeah. a lot of like, you know, just musicals in general. Sure. Yeah, it's, mm -hmm. it's my favorite. And I think it's good for because I never thought about it before. Um, I mean, I, I thought about it more recently and stuff with conversations with other people and stuff. But like, it was kind of the idea of like also playing video games and stuff too. Is like me being just a white guy. Mm -hmm. I had representation in games yeah. or movies, yeah. and I never really thought about like being someone of color yeah. and being like, "Ah, oh, well, I'll just watch this with this white guy sure. or the, play this game as this white guy and yeah. not not feel like I'm represented." I never really thought about not being represented, of course, you know. So like having more stuff like this, I think I think that like soul dove into that a little bit more yeah. too, mm -hmm. with just you know people of color and a different style of music and stuff. And what was the even a dead one? The what? The Land of the Dead. Oh, one. that one was really good. I really like that one. Uh, I don't. I, don't but I know. can't remember the name. I was going to say the the first one. I feel like kind of started doing that was Princess and the Frog. Um, kind of di dove in there with uh, Tiana. I think was her name. Yeah. But I mean, there was like. Oh, you don't know Coco. 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 Yeah. Oh, I see. Okay. I'm like Land of the Dead. I love Coco. But yeah, <laughs> the, Disney's been having more and more like that, which is good because it's and it's also been varying. Yeah, sure. From different and it's, cultures it's, and it, different. It's different than like Pocahontas. Yeah. Yes. Or something like that. So, no, and something like this, I mean, if you try to go literal, and I'm looking for myself in here, I'd be like, well, seems like the only white guy was the person that drove them from their land, you know? But you can really, at least in, in, I can, like, I can see an uncle that I have in this guy. Like, sure. I can see my grandma putting, doing these things. I can relate to a lot of these characters, like that family dynamic of, uh, uh, I don't know, it really speaks to me. 
I, I really enjoyed, but I also really hated at points too, right? I mean, like, I think uh, the abuela did what she could, but I don't think she did very well. Sure. In some response. I definitely feel as though she could have done better. I almost hate that my favorite song was We Don't Talk About Bruno, and that's my biggest problem with the movie is what they did to Bruno. Yeah. You know? Like, they just, like, you know, she didn't protect her son. Yeah, I mean, if you're the bearer of bad news, people are going to blame the messenger. Yeah, I get you. you I understand. And and that's what happens. Yeah. And that's exactly what they were doing is, like, sure, he's seeing the future. Like, I don't think Bruno caused your hair to go away. Mm-hmm. He just saw that it was going to happen. Yeah. Right? And it's like, you got to you gotta have that line to understand, like, hey, sometimes you don't want to know what the future is. But if you want to know, Bruno yeah. can tell you what it will be. The, the only one you is, know? like, maybe the wedding. Because, like, if he told her that and that influenced how she thought, then that turned the weather. Sure. I guess, like, yeah, you could have had that. Maybe. What was the line which, you know, the, the grandma talked about, like, all oh, your, like, implying that she was drinking during the wedding or something like that, right? Was there a line like that? I can't remember what it was. Uh, that Bruno was drinking? No, that uh, uh, Mirabel was. When she's just, you know, she's saying crazy things, you know, but she knows, like, she, at the window, she says, like, she knows what's going on. Like, she just threw it under the bus, you know? Like, out to. Oh, you don't mean the wedding. You mean during Antonio's no, I'm, thing. I'm, I'm, yeah, Because oh, during sorry, Antonio's thing, she's okay. like, the magic is strong, and yeah. so are the drinks. Sure, like, yeah. There was that. Like, I just thought that was so shitty. And then, in, you know. <sighs> Uh, I, th- I, I took it as let's get back to partying. Sure. Yeah. Not, that not that this young girl is was drinking drunk alcohol. and seeing things. <laughs> no, yeah. I don't know. I kind of took it like she was making an excuse why she would say these silly things. And then later at the window, pretty much confirmed that, yeah, these things are happening. Sure. I mean, yeah. the abuela is a flawed character. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's the point of the movie. Yeah. Sure. Is yeah. that she, and that's what I was saying before, she is focused on the magic, mm-hmm. and that's what keeps them safe. So it yeah. has to be. Versus, you know, what's important is that we are a family and that we are together, mm-hmm. and that what gift you have isn't the, isn't the most important thing. Yeah, sure. it's not all that you can bring to the family. Yeah, yeah. and you know, Mirabelle confronts her on that, and then that's when the whole house falls apart. But that's why I like like, I'm glad that Abuelo was the one to find her, even though I was like, yeah. fuck, I don't want her to show up. But like her being there and having that conversation, especially no, after the stuff, like she. <laughs> I'm glad that it wasn't like she didn't come up there and start blaming her. Yeah. It turned into where is Mirabelle and yeah. everyone started looking for Mirabelle. Because it's not about it's not about uh keeping things stagnant, right? Or just protecting something. It's about progressing something. So I needed to have that scene. I'm glad that it happened. Definitely. Sure. Yeah. Um but just having her having her do that and then having them all come together and work and there's an understanding too, like I like the the final song when they're building the house. Yeah. And you have like, oh, you're strong. It's like, yeah, but I cry. It's like, I cry too, you yeah. know? No, I and there's a relation of like, I don't know, emotions and personality. And Validation of feelings. It's not, she's the strong one. That's yeah. who she is. She's the perfect yeah. one. That's who she is. You know, it's not just that. It's, it's a, a deepening of the identity of the person. Yeah. Rather than just being yeah. face value. Yeah. Not ex- I'm not just the bald ex- guy. Eric's not just the fat guy. Yeah. You're not just the nose guy. There's other parts. Why is that the thing? Which, I don't know. I don't have much. What's with Rick's you. thing? I'm trying to be loud so much. <laughs> oh, you're not just a loud guy. Is that better? <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, you know what I mean? Like, there's there's more to each of us than than those. Well, it's yeah, yeah it's you what know? you're expected to be versus it's, what you are. Yeah, and it's the same idea here as to as to all these characters and stuff too. And I like Antonio being like, I need you, and Damn it's like good. she is the, she's there finding like she's talking to their emotions and their their secrets and their, you know, all that kind of stuff too and finding deep inside and comforting them, you know? Mm-hmm. And that's why Antonio kind of latches on a little bit. And I was like, maybe that's, maybe there is a gift. And then they showed the whole thing where like the door disappeared. Yeah, and I'm like, yeah. oh, well maybe. Maybe not. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I thought it was like, I had a real like a quirk. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Where like, oh, at some point no, you get, I get it. You. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't know how it works. And, and it, you know, she kind of has a new one, you know, with, she gets the front door. I kind of wish I could see what her room looked like. But, I don't know. I, when that little girl couldn't do that, and just like the look she gave, I don't know. These animators, they can pull my heartstrings, I guess, just really easily. But like when she's like looking up, knowing that she failed and doesn't want to be ostracized or judged, it just fucking broke my heart. But it didn't break my heart as much as Bruno's plate. Yeah, like sure. That, that really was my heart. That I was almost really... was poisoned against the grandma forever <laughs> when I saw that plate. <laughs> It is of his own choosing, but yeah, sure. and I, I get it. But they don't talk about it. Like it's a it's a a shush subject. Yeah. yeah. 
Well, yeah, because then it turns like, well, where'd he go? It's like, no one knows. Why it's, didn't you go look for him? Like, then there's a whole thing, and then, like, they just, we'll just pretend it didn't happen, and we'll just ignore yeah, it and, and don't worry about it. What's you know? yeah, right? the, uh, the grandma's whole thing is, like, everything has to be perfect. Yeah. 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 So, yeah. Like, we have to put on the face, we have to. Mm. And we follow what she says, and yeah. that's what it yeah. is. Even the, the her, uh, Mirabelle's dad. Mm-hmm. Right, he was like, "No, we we don't talk about it. Everything has to be perfect. Ab- Abuela will be so mad at us. Like, it just has to be perfect for this." I really like how uh, Bruno's <laughs> uh, prophecies solidify from sand to glass. That's really cool. Yeah, uh, just power. I, I, yeah, but I was also kind of wondering, like, so like you know, the one girl gets her power and she can just hear everything. I'm like, oh yeah. shit! The one girl's like, she's so oh, damn. This is easy to lift, you know. Little boy at Burgess lands and he can hear it. Yeah. Where did Bruno like when he got his? Like, oh, all right, let me let me drop the sand, light these on fire, yeah, and I, do all this, and now I can see shit. I wonder know? if there is like a cultural, mm-hmm. like fortune telling ritual that he's maybe following or something. You know? Well, that's why I was saying. It's like maybe it's not a requirement, but maybe it helps him focus, kind of like putting him in a certain state of mind or like a meditation sort of thing to help him see. Mm-hmm. Things. It's like if Eric Skiff was exercising demons, like there are procedures for exercising demons through our culture and our religion. Yes. Sure. sure. Kind of thing. Exorcising. Exor. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Not sure. like Ninja Three. I, I the Dominion. suppose that's true. Um, yeah. yeah, I was just curious on that because everyone else seemed very straightforward. I suppose. Yeah. Sure. Right. Well, yeah, like that guy or uh, that kid, like immediately talks to the animals, and all the animals seem to love him. Yeah. Like, that just happens. Yeah. Well, if you were wandering around in the jungle and nobody could understand you, and then suddenly you found someone that understood you, you would latch on to that person, right? Sure, but, I suppose. I guess. <laughs> it, but it's implied that they all understand each other as well? I don't know. Because, like, know, the rats were taking a bath together. The rats were taking a bath well, together. Well, all the rats would sure. understand each other. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that but makes sense. that... That one... Uh, that jaguar was going to eat those rats. That's what... No, I, mean, I wouldn't do. eat you. I mean... Yeah, if you, the circumstances were right... If the circumstances were very wrong, is how I would put it. <laughs> the language, the language barrier may cause problems for people to eat people or for animals to eat animals, right? Yeah. Like if you land on an island, can't speak the language, and there's like, oh, no, they're right. and they're just saying some stuff. I don't know what they're saying, and you're just like, oh, okay. And then there's a fire. Like, oh, we're having dinner. Yeah, and they just talk to you in the fire. In the fire? Well, I don't know. Whatever. How they cook you? Like ah, there was a misunderstanding. They obviously were saying something else. <laughs> you know? They were asking. May we eat you? And you were saying, yes, yes. <laughs> Hungry. Yeah. <food. laughs> yeah. I, I love in hindsight, because we, you know, we, could, we could see him during the We Don't Talk About Bruno song. But in hindsight, now that we know that he tries to stay close with his family while being out of sight, he's like dancing in the background to the song about like ostracizing him. But he's like trying to like I'm part of it too, you know. It's kind yeah. of sad to think about, but it's also well, I like the detail of him in there. He's also you know he was also dancing to it as well to try to feel close. But the subject <laughs> of the song is about him being away. See, so he's yeah. living my ideal life at the family gathering. Yes, I want to be in the corner. I want to yeah. be away. I don't want to be a part of that. Yeah, <laughs> you're just watching like ah, that looks nice. <laughs> <laughs> I just, my family would ostracize me. <laughs> I just really like, and it, it kind of reminds me a little bit of Jojo Rabbit, but I like mm-hmm. how when we, especially as we're building up to Bruno, it's so scary. Yeah. And then... That shot of the glass. I love the, and then the he's just gone, just and you're like, up. oh. And then it turns into a chase, and then it's yeah. more of like, wait, why is he chasing him? And then it turns into like something different. Yeah. And, but the build up to it so far has been like he's, yeah. you know, rats on his back and he's yeah. evil and bad. And the and endless and chasm in which you could fall turns out to not be so endless at all. Yeah, like right? things yeah. aren't which quite is exactly what, they look what his character is. Yeah, like, you think that he's going. He to reaches be down and he saves her. Yeah. And he's well, like, oh, you're sweaty, it, and then he falls. It's honestly a story for almost all of it because mm-hmm. you're looking at it just on the surface. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But you need to go deeper to really understand what's there, and that's. That's if if you t- if you go there and you're like oh man, they were at the surface that looks scary but really it's not that turns out not so deep it's not that bad once you actually <laughs> look deeper you know sure. and that's yeah. kind of like with all the characters they're looking at the surface of their gifts and not deeper into each one so it's like a nice little nod to that whole thing too and also just being raised with expectations you know so uh, Dolores <laughs> did say like she's saying at one point like. She's like, I can hear him whispering or something when she was talking about Bruno. Yeah. Which I guess she could, though she 
says that she can hear rats well, in so the walls. She has known that he has been there the whole time. Yeah. But she hinted at it by mm. saying the rats have also been saying yeah. that this terrible thing gotcha. happened. She had some pretty funny moments in the movie, too. I really liked her. Like, I heard you or whatever she did across the, from the... I know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. The the tense dinner scene where... where uh, that What's was, his name was going to propose when yeah, they're like staring back and forth at each other, yeah. <laughs> like don't break. Yeah. And she breaks line of sight for a second, <laughs> and she's already told somebody else. He, and I, he's expounding upon his woes. I have so much love in. Yeah, him. it doesn't matter who. Oh, yeah, I just need to love. <laughs> <laughs> I do like that. And it's like you know the one girl wasn't interested in him, and that was another thing too, where it's like I thought that maybe Mirabelle's power in the beginning was maybe like maybe she can kind of bring out what's inside of someone yeah like she kind of like brought out Antonio's strength and helped him to push forward she was bringing out uh Luisa's like softer side you know mm -hmm. whether yeah. that doesn't need that to be yeah. super tougher. Strong. and then like also she pulled out that little bit where um Dolores I think it was talking about the beloved that will never be kind of thing yeah. but that was also kind of with Bruno song a little bit more so I was like but maybe Mirabelle's kind of like pulling out these like secrets and feelings deep inside and that's that's her gift mm -hmm. and that is but, a power because Toru has that in Fruits Basket that's what she does I was thinking of Book of Boba Fett whenever he's, you know Fennec is like your time with him has made you weak he's like no it has made me strong <laughs> to be with the clan <laughs> spoiler <clears throat> I wondered if there was a nods. I think it was in the last song. The the one was they said about snow and then they said let it go. And I was like, oh, I wonder if it's a nod towards Frozen. Mm -hmm. But then the other one was when Dolores and the other guy when they were talking about stuff. And he was like, I see you and I hear you. Um, but there was a song I keep. I kept trying to place what it was. But there was a song that was like, I see you, I see you, I hear you, I hear you. And I was trying to place like what it was. And I think it's a song from Rent. But I don't know if it has any connection at all when they were writing stuff if they were going to like nod towards you know, popular know. stuff or anything but both of those kind of stood out to me I thought it was a fun uh, movie I don't get the chance to watch a whole lot of new musicals so and it being a Disney movie it's yeah good. it's fun short sweet sure and it's one of those things too and I, I I think Disney has been doing this more too where it's like there's not like a just a bad guy villain we have to defeat Sure. You know, yeah. they've been doing, I feel like, a little bit more complex, like... They've been doing a lot of family dynamics. Sure. Recently, I feel like. Yeah. yeah. Like, typically, um, like, I don't think Inside Out necessarily has, like, a villain you have to beat. But it's more about controlling and overcoming, like, emotions and... Yeah. Discovering things, yourself. You know? and... um, soul... I don't feel like really had like a villain. It was like here's the process how things are supposed I mean, to go. We're just, that's what happens. It's, it's because we're tackling you know uh, subjects that aren't so black and white as to like. And now you have defeated it. Sure. You know? And sure. I and like, I like this, this I like end, that though. Yeah, I like okay. having more of a complexity of like, well, who's mm -hmm. the villain in this? It's like, well, there's not really like a villain. It's not like the grandma was evil and we ha had to defeat her. It was that she was. Misunderstanding. Certainly, and almost looking at it, antagonist. Sure, but, and you yeah. can have that without having a villain. Sure, you know, and that's that's kind of what I like with some of these. Like, Coco kind of has one. Kind of. Um, I haven't really watched it all the way through. I've caught bits and pieces and stuff, and I know of like one character where it's like, well, he's kind of the villain right yeah. there. But he's um, not the um, Maleficent. <laughs> mm, I suppose not. No, it's, I mean he's not. You mean the character? Yeah. Yeah, he's not that. <laughs> I just mean like, I guess he's not Maleficent. I don't yeah. know. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It's just interesting to see like stories that are being created and told without just having like, here is Jafar that we must sure. beat him. And now we, everything's all better, you know? Mm -hmm. While little bits of these stories on the side or something. So. And then just some first class standout animation with, uh, especially Mirabelle's dress throughout like oh it's just so fuck like it's just you don't because it looks so good you, you don't even focus on it half the time anymore like if, if it if it looked worse we would be like oh they're really doing something here but because it looks so good like my mind kind of like glazes over i really try to force myself to pay attention like how everything in these movies is intention <laughs> you know yeah. it's sure. not just go and then and it's cause and effect it's intention yeah. you know so it's 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 outstanding like, yeah. I was even noticing in the scene where she's under the bed with her little brother, mm -hmm. like, you could see arm hairs yeah. 
Like, they weren't, yeah. like, in focus, and they weren't, like, fully rendered or anything like that. But yeah. you know that glint that you get off of, like, a single arm hair that's hitting the light just perfectly? Mm-hmm. You could see those yeah. on their arms. There's, like, it a... Was, like, there's like a softness to the crispness. Yeah, if that it's makes like sense. <laughs> it's like it's super crisp. Yeah, and then they put like a Snapchat filter on it. Yeah, and made it look really smooth and, mm. and everything looks great. Sure. I also I don't know if I said this at all, but I loved the house. <laughs> you did. Yeah, the house is good. The house is great. I think you talked more about the house. It was like its own character. Yeah, it was it's really terrible cool. death scene. It's, it's like it was. <laughs> it's like the carpet in Aladdin. You know, it never uh, talks, but you can understand it enough. And if it dies, you're like, no, you know, like that's yeah. terrible. I like that character. You know, so it's when like it, when it gets unthreaded. Man, Doctor Strange's know. cape. <clears throat> kind of yeah, and it's fun to have characters like that where it's like, you know, it is like an inanimate object. That has some kind of sentience, yeah. and you learn to and care about it. It's expressing it. emotion. So yeah. how do you show that, like with the shutters and the, the you know, different angles that you know, you can say is like, oh, like that's the eyebrow. tiles in the window, window. like. <laughs> yeah. No, they did a good job with showing intention to, with that with the house. I really like that. Yeah. yeah, yeah. The Witcher did that. The house got up and walked around. True. <laughs> house, move, house moving castle. <laughs> you need to fucking watch The Witcher, Aaron. Good. You guys watch without me. I don't have any chance now to watch anymore. It's all we all said gone. watch it, goodness. and you can watch it with us. We got sent those books. You can read those. Yeah. That yeah. too. Uh, uh, maybe. No, I, I like the uh, I like a lot of the songs. I like the Under the Surface one. Um, I also like that we don't talk about Bruno. That was the third. I thing. will be re-listening. To that was the third thing the that I was here. aware of was the we don't talk about Bruno yeah. thing. I, I was. Pretty sure there was a song revol- revolving around that. I saw like a meme or a something at some point that talk- said about that, but I didn't know necessarily what who, it was. Who Bruno was? Yeah, yeah. You know so. the uh, the interesting thing about especially reacting to musicals or any type of uh, thing that does have a musical element is I never enjoy something like a, a musical. Like if I'm really into a musical like Hamilton, I enjoy it so much more the third time I've watched it versus the first time. The first time it's all new and you're like, okay, I like this, this is cool. But it, whenever I revisit music, it's when I really start to enjoy it. Yeah. So like, it's like the sure. opposite of a the no. advantage of a reaction is that I'm like, oh, this is nice, but I can't like, I can't feel it yet. Sure. You know, like the first time you watch a watch a a musical or something like that, yeah. you're getting the plot. Sure. The second time you get it, you watch it, you get the lyrics. The mm-hmm. third time you get it, you get the themes. Yeah. And then the fourth time, the soul. <laughs> We're watching a movie. Yeah, fun movie. Uh, I enjoyed it, and I hope everybody watching enjoyed our reaction to it. I really enjoyed it. So, what we get next? Who knows? We don't talk about what happens next. Actually, what? it talks about all the time. Remember, patreon.com yeah. blindly. Literally, you can go over, it. vote, and talk about what movie we will do next. Let's this was voted. See what's next. Early access. Yes, up to four movies available right now. You told me I'd grow a gut, and just like you said.